Here's the abandoned Westland Mall in Columbus, Ohio. Opened in, I think, 65. I'll have to double check. And it closed in 2011, so it's been closed for 12 years. This is one of the three original malls in the area, uh, overshadowed by new ones. So, I certainly would love to explore, but kind of can't do that. So this is good enough. Here's the inside. Looks pretty cool though. Run down. I was 10 years old when this mall closed. I don't remember ever being in here. If I was, somebody would have to tell me. Yeah, this got overshadowed by Puddle Mall north of here, but Tuttle Mall is unfortunately facing the same fate now. It's dying. I grew up going to Tuttle. But yeah, this is the mall that preceded it. I heard rumors that this is slated for demolition, and there's a carnival over there, but... There's a big fence around here. I don't know if that's just because there's a gun show in the former Sears. So I don't know if that's just part of that or if uh, this is that this actually means something or not. Might as well show you. There's the mall. And then if we come around here, that was a bar from what I can see, a restaurant. Over here, there was a former, uh, an old uh, Staples that was part of the mall as well. That used to be Staples, and then that big building there was Sears. Yeah, there's a gun show in there right now. And then that space there was Macy's. So, and then on the back you had like J.C. Penney and all the other places. That was probably Kaufman's or Lazarus, whatever, before it was Macy's. But yeah, this is Westland Mall, 12 years abandoned, possibly slated for demolition. Well, the rumors were true. This is indeed slated for demolition. There's a bulldozer, whatever you call it, right there. And there's the back of the mall right here. One of the other entrances. And then there's part of the former Macy's. And yeah, there's that section.